What's going on everybody? The past two trading days have been absolutely insane. Possibly the best trading days ever for me and the community in the Discord. Make sure to check the link in the description because we went absolutely nuclear. Catching the exact low a day and riding the explosive pump on both Tuesday and Wednesday. In this video, I'm going to break down exactly how I did it, revealing the strategies behind using Power of 3, Market Maker Buyer Sell Models, Turtle Soup, SMTs, and more. Trust me, these golden nuggets will elevate your trading game, give you the confidence you need to make precise moves in the market. So buckle up because I don't want you to miss a second of this. And as always, if you find value in this video, please make sure to hit that like button. As a new YouTuber, I cannot explain how much it helps if you guys are able to hit that like button for me. We have been consistently getting 50 likes, so let's aim for that again. Also, don't forget to subscribe if you're new. As always, you know I'm dropping trading insight, I'm dropping educational videos, so please, two things I ask, just like, just subscribe, and let's get straight into the video. First. No, what do we got? Previous week low, SMT. Noted. Noted indeed. Noted very closely. Okay. Obviously, we didn't just catch long today. We caught it yesterday as well. Our previous week SMT on the Monday here. Uh, at probability, high resistance low. Especially rejected back in the range. All right, you see kind of the weekly rejection block. You know, remember from Bitcoin, how we showed that one time. Um... Crunk was hating on it, bro, talking about a Bitcoin chart. But, you know, if you remember that weekly wick, right? Obviously, we talked about this shit so fucking long ago. Wow, look at that. Beautiful, beautiful. Right, we can see our accumulation, manipulation, distribution. You know, into, right, that distribution being the manipulation. Right, from that lower time frame retracement lower. Right, you can see an unmitigated order block here. So, we push into it, pushes us a little bit lower. Right where we have our high resistance, high probability, excuse me, our high probability, high resistance, low. Short in here, you know, like, I wasn't, I'm not going to lie, like, you know, I was short down into here. On the open? Hell yeah, I was. Um, Especially, you know, on this Monday open. Uh, can't remember, I was talking to Mello. Um, but either way, I was telling him, you know, we were both short around the same time. And we were like, bro, we're going to hold to these lows, you know, and then down into this low resistance into this this failure swing here would have been a banger if you know everything actually shifted the way we can't uh way that i was planning um obviously that smt quick rejection especially being exactly where we are with the narrative there it goes <clears throat> you know so i wasn't too worried about missing this soup here right wasn't tripping at all what do we see 15 minute breaker close wow pretty Pretty hard on that one, you know, enter inside of here. And guess what never gets filled? All right, breakaway gap. And this is a very, just looking at it, very, very um, opportunistic time to have an SMT inside of this fair value gap. Just keep that for your, for your notes. Either way, you'll see this pattern a million fucking times. Right, even from here, right? We're gonna, I'm gonna circle this accumulation right here. Right, we accumulate, manipulate, distribute, Boom, retest, EQ, boom. Okay, so now how many times can you spot that? Lower time frame here, inside of the higher time frame, break lower, and then lower time frame, right? We can see it here even, and then inside of the higher time frame, right? So kind of just a simple little power of three, you know, intuition um, along with the SMT. And I say intuition, but that's just, I mean, that's just how the power of three is. Like, you'll see it, like, screen time, you know, higher time frame. You know, I can see this as, like, a, you know, like, a couple, of like, like, we'll see it here. All right, see? Accumulation. Manipulate. SMT. Close back inside the range. Like, look at that. So precise. Um... You know, even if you have a fucking huge stop, right? What did we do? We just let that motherfucker run, you know? This was my trade. It's like, look at this, you know? Yeah, I mean, look, like, uh, this is a we very weird thing to say, and I'm glad, Melo, you hopped in here. um, Because I was even saying this, right? You know, I was short. As soon as we broke lower with the with the, the gap in log, like, fuck yeah, I'm shorting. I don't give a fuck. Like, dude, like, look at everything, like, you know, we're respecting, respecting, first purge, second purge inside of the, I mean, excuse me, first purge, 
you know, second purge reacting back inside of the range, you know, after that SMT with the reaction, that was when it was like, all right, all right. I'm pretty sure I even like entered like this. Like you, you guys know me. I'll just enter it like the, the breaker as it's forming. Um, <clears throat> either way, kind of like a little daily recap from here. I know you guys are interested in this day, but there's absolutely no fucking way, you know, I can pull up this day and be like, okay, yeah, open, low, boom. I literally, that's what we did because what it's a, um, anyway. Because it's a Wednesday continuation, um, delivering from Tuesday. I posted today, um, if you guys like saw a little Twitter post, you know, like your session profiles from each session, you know, going from session to session, session to session. <laughs> you know, let's shut the fuck up. Um, <clears throat> you know, your if then thinking. Right, if then Asian session here, there's no, like, like this was literally the final leg lower. Like, if we would have souped it and came in again, and kept that, like, I'm not gonna lie, I probably would have missed it, right, but we can see, you know, the SMT, like, that's damn near the final leg, especially with, you know, how ES was, um, you know, and delivering from the SMT, right, that's the failure swing before the turtle soup, we also have, right, that side over here, right, and just because, just because, um, just because, you know, I show you guys the market maker models like this, where we have that low to the left, right? You don't always want to trust that, you know, as your stop loss. I've told you guys before, um, you know, in certain scenarios, you know, you can do that. But it, especially more recently, and a lot uh, me knowing that a lot of you guys trade this, the lower time frame, it's not necessarily so as true for the low time frame. Um especially like with um some people say consequent encroachment but i like to say mean threshold of rejection blocks um because you know like a rejection blocks an order block in my you know in my eyes like um bro i had a one-on-one -on -one with this guy and i'm and, and i'm talking about high time frame wicks i'm gonna let you guys i'm gonna let you guys ask what is in a high time frame rejection block what what's inside of the wick with you know the way we had our asian smart money reversal into um the london session right we use i mean you will guys see in a lot of the trades like if you actually look at the executions um i mean like some of it i'll say like some of it i won't sometimes you, you boys just be figuring out on your own um but like it's literally an asian breaker right you just use asian high as the breaker for london's uh time-based manipulation the wick highs into the body highs um I mean, you guys even see it here, right? With that, that pattern, right? Another circled, uh, excuse me, another, you know, uh, pattern almost circled with it accumulating, manipulating, distributing. Want to see me do it again? Here it is. Right? After inducing more liquidity into the highs. Um, oh my God, if you can't see that buy model at that point, you a little slow. It's okay, though. That's what we're here to help. If, you, if you're a little slow, it's all right. Because, you know, this wasn't perfect. Um, Actually, kind of was. That's how we always talk about, right? Using the breaker. Closing and displacing above. Internal, external, right? No real, like, breakaway gap here, in a sense. Um, But... Double check three. Yeah, we do form that order block. I guess thinking. Um and that perfectly balanced hourly candle um delivering from the order block, which makes sense not to deliver past the low, right? And then you see here you get right that failure swing. Right? Same thing as here with that SMT, right? Um coming in, you know, from the turtle soup failure swing. Or excuse me, excuse me turtle souping the failure swing right but not the actual turtle soup um you know and like ones like these you don't gotta like catch the bottom you know like you, you guys even see me you know i just sometimes like fucking zoom the picture in and like you know just make it look a little a little better so i can post it like obviously you guys see that um you know because like sometimes i'll enter like okay that would probably have been a little bit harder 
Um, I mean, oh, I'm on the five minute. Uh, yeah, but even even here into that nine nine oh five new hourly open low resistance like we talked about here, right? Open or <clears throat> even here like accumulating manipulating. Right, you see how we don't need to deliver past it, right, with the breakaway gap, because we've displaced past our highs. We'll even put it like this, because, you know, sometimes you guys are like, the body or the wick, the body or the wick. Boom, just like this. Make it simple. Displaced above, closed above, right, see 845 into, oh shit, yeah, 5 minute close above, 15 minute close above, right, because we get that 9 close right here. And you see that wick is clearly above. Right, so then we go into a 15 minute fair value gap internal. Well, it might not be a 15 minute fair value gap. Let's see. Yeah, not a 15, but purple. propulsion block, order block, breaker block. This is literally the key to like the breakaway gaps, right? Because it'll just either there from run, right? And you also always have that protected low from the fair value gap, right? And even like if I enter here, right, this is how I entered today. No lie on that, that one lawn that you guys saw. And then I ended up, you know, adding in again. And then you could just zoom, make the picture look better. Okay. Obviously, you guys see all of them aren't like that. I'd be sending some bullshit sometimes. That's not where the take profit was. Um, yeah, either way, right? You see that? Stop below the low in the breakaway gap. And like, yeah, you get scared, but just don't be a pussy, bro. Like, seriously, like, like I'm not even trying to be like rude, you know. Like, just if you you put the stop in, you have the idea that's a breaker, close above, order block, high probability order block, um, right? We have our clear accumulation with our low time frame distribution, um, right? Accumulation, manipulation, lower time frame here above the high, and then lower into your higher time frame manipulation with that SMT below the low. Okay, so, all right, I hope you guys can see this, all right, and just work with me, work with me, because this is, like, how breakers and, like, the breakaway gaps, like, this is how shit works, it's how I'm able to, like, catch them and, like, long, like, I, I'm longing above old highs, but still turtle souping, right, because I know lower time frame what needs to happen with our internal, external here, accumulation, holy fuck, another one, right, how many times have I pointed one out, um, let's go back a little bit. Shit, where were we at? Oh, here. Right. Here. Right. Okay, pretty simple. Um, And then even to here, right? Look where we're reacting off of. So we're probably either going to react off of here. Oh, damn, we displaced pretty high. So I guarantee we at least touch EQ, but, you know, from this high, excuse me, from this low to this high. Guarantee we touch EQ. That's got to be EQ. Right on it. Oh, yeah, way past it. Well, I'm tripping. I was thinking maybe like right here. My eye's a little off. That's a high? No, it's not a little high. Well, no, well, yeah, I guess I'm... My eye's a little off today, I guess. It's, a, it's I'm on the side computer. Just blame it on that. Anyway, obviously we're in a, you know, past an equilibrium. Wait, continuing. See our low time frame soup there. Ooh, shit. Where's the two open? Oh, tell me it's right. Oh, yeah, that looks... All right. Let me, let me chill, let me chill. All right, either way, but also going into the breakers, right? The same thing that I was talking about here, right? With that initial, like, really quick thinking of wanting to go short and then instantly flipping. Like, I, I know it's, like, somewhat retarded to you guys. Yeah, it is a little bit. Um, But it comes in to that new candle hourly open. Also, you see our 5 and 15 minute candles. Oops, you set that. Okay, so we see on the hourly here, right? Where's our new day? Right, right here. So let me check the four hour because I'm pretty sure, yeah, we broke that candle high. Okay, and then even here. Even here, like back to back, right? These smack on the four hour. Right, with our perfectly balanced, how I was telling you guys, if you saw in the analysis, like with a perfectly balanced hourly candle and a perfectly balanced four hour candle, right, we have, you know, we have, you know, signatures down here 
right? An OT delivery, SMT, turtle soup. That makes sense to deliver us past this high, you know, these low resistance high, low resistance liquidity run. But we see on a four hour, right? We close above both of them. All right, big ass candle, shit. New four hour candle opens low. What do we open low into because we've closed above? Right? Order block or breaker block. However you want to see it, right? We just closed above it. We open low. High. Right? We don't necessarily close high. But either way, right? With the continuation, we shouldn't deliver past that low with the breakaway gap. We have this next high, right? Where we open, come into a discount of the previous four hour candle. Right? With the pretty indecisive close, right? OTE. Wick, open low, continuation, right? Because the you know six, we come in from six being protected, boom, right? And why is six protected? Because this is not going to be a low resistance liquidity run because of that original SMT soup there. So no low resistance liquidity run, even if you were looking at it like mid four hour candle. Um, you know you have a fake LR to the bottom or fake LR to the top, right? And you choose one. Obviously, I mean, I hope you wouldn't choose this one where there's no real SMT versus this one and us rejecting back inside the range, also higher time frame being bullish, right? I get the daily charts ass. We literally just we literally just manipulated past our most recent low, previous month low as well, and just delivered higher. It's crazy, but it happens, like, you know, after fucking accumulating. And, uh, you know, what was the news? Elections. Um... You see everybody saying not to trade, but I mean, I'm not going to be the one to say like, trade? Yeah. But you, just, you guys, if you're confident, you see what you're saying, trade. If you're not, don't trade, like regardless of any situation. So inside of that four hour, right? How fucking easy is that? I see food, right? Didn't really, oh, I guess we close above the body, right? 15 minute. Let's see what the 30 minute says though. I mean, let me pull it back here just a little bit. Obviously, we, we know what the higher time frame says. Let's see if the. Oh, 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 I mean, you can't even put that in a book. I mean, come on. Come on. New 10 open. 30 minute internal. External. Gosh. That's, that's, that's pretty. Anyway, um. Right, obvious breakaway gap. All right, get we came in the fair value gap, but if you originally go like this, right, sometimes what I mean is by breakaway gap is I know for a fact this lower quadrant, right, our lower 50%, the discount pretty much of the fair value gap is not going to get filled. Excuse me. You can allow for a tomahawk. All right, just a little bit. Just a little bit. Either way, 15 minute looks good. Um, Reaccumulate, right? Internal. Yeah, that looks a little poopy. Um, you know, sometimes you get a rejection block. Sometimes you get that new candle to liquidate the low. Well, I mean, at that point, 10.55, you'd probably wait either way. Um, you know, first tap into the order block, second tap 